I'm Destiny Wagner, Miss Earth Belize. Thank you. The color I chose, which is also my absolutely favorite color, is the color nude. Nude is a skin flesh tone. And I chose this color because it's such a complex color. And as human beings, we are the most complex animal on earth. The color nude is the only color that has changed its definition throughout the course of the years. Back then, the color nude used to be associated with only one skin tone, which was often a lighter shade. Now, the color nude is all of our skin tones. It's my skin tone, it's your skin tone. And as a child, I often struggled with embracing my melanin. But today, as a 25 year old entrepreneur and businesswoman, I've grown to love and adore my skin. And I wanna encourage everyone to do the same. I believe this color relates to the earth because in every country, there's so many different beautiful skin tones walking around. The purpose of our skin was designed to protect and hold our bodies together. So if our new skin can protect our bodies, there's no reason why our bodies cannot protect the earth. Thank you. The title of this poem is called Birds of a Different Feather. I was never the dove, I was always the crow. I prayed for white feathers, but they just wouldn't grow. The more I cried, the darker my feathers grew. I would never leave my nest. Others were offended when I flew. Yet we ate the same worms and lived on the same soil. But we could not mix, for you were water and I was oil. We both have a wide chest, beak, and chirp. But I was considered a disadvantage, while you were considered a perk. You can't help that you were born a dove, and I can't help that I was born a crow. At one point, I thought I was in love until I realized you just didn't know. You didn't know that others feared me due to the feathers on my head before they even knew that I preyed on the weak and ate the dead. But you are a dove considered so beautiful, so pure, so true. Even before Christ, Noah chose you. So you must live in your skin and I must live in mine as well. Oh dove, my beautiful dove. Only time can tell. To her, beauty has always been defined as someone's character. We can tell the beauty of someone without even looking at their face. You'll be able to feel the magnetic energy that is drawing you to them organically and that is beauty. 
to be seen is a plus, but you have a beauty that can be felt, a beauty that can be heard, that to me is real beauty. Belize Destiny Wagner She eats at least 7 different vegetables and fruits every day. Besides that, she meditates to be healthy not only in body but in mind. Her meditation consists of praying, listening to calm music, and writing. Destiny Wagner, Belize. It has the most colors in its flag with a total of 12 colors. Belize has the largest living barrier reef. Belize. Belize. Destiny Wagner is an entrepreneur and digital influencer who stands for the sustainability of marine life. She and her family run a foundation that has been supplying meals for small villages for the past 10 years. I will choose a word or a phrase in the bowl and you're going to expand it for me, all right? Yes, and I'm still recording this on my phone, my, my other phone, correct? Okay, yes. Are you ready? Yes, ma'am. All right, I'm going to pick a word for you. And your word is surprise. Surprise. I'm someone who loves to be surprised, and I think there's a beauty in being surprised, especially if you are receiving a gift or an honorable mention. However, what I don't like to be surprised in is natural disasters or pandemics such as the coronavirus. That is a surprise that none of us anticipated. However, at the end of the rain, there's always a rainbow. And right now on this earth, origin is giving us that rainbow to fulfill the duties as a queen even during a virtual even during a virtual pageant and even during a pandemic so as much as you love being surprised let's focus on being surprised and great things thank you all right thank you very much miss belize belize he's now in front of our camera hello belize are you on mute <laughs> Much better. There we go. I can hear you now, Belize. All right. Now, just stand where you are. Here is uh, your question. How far can technology go to help save the environmental situation we are in? I'm so thankful to live in a digital age right now. Because of technology, we are able to spread awareness of things that are happening, not only in my country, but in other countries as well. However, technology can also be used to save our environment because by incorporating innovation and technology as well as sustainability, we can use those two things to come together. I'm so thankful to be a woman now in 2021 and being able to have access to, this thing, to these things, such as solar energy and renewable energy. When mixing them together, there's nothing that we cannot do. So I am thankful to be in the digital age of technology and it will be used to save the planet. Thank you. Don't know if you know that you are now crowned Miss Earth 2021. You are it. Congratulations, Belize. You are the Miss Earth of 2021. Oh my, I feel a bunch of emotions right now. I, oh my God. Let it sink in for a while, and when you're ready, only when you're ready, share us how you're feeling inside there, Belize. You took home the crown. My country has never placed at Miss Earth before, nor have we ever had an international crown. So right now, this is what we needed, and I'm happy to have represent such a gorgeous country. I, I'm overwhelmed right now with emotions. I don't even, the words and the gratitude it's hard to, it's very hard to express, but I am thankful, and I'm thankful for the Miss Earth organization and th thankful for my team as well. 
Well, Belize, you have made history, as you pointed out, the first time that your country has placed in a pageant, taken the crown in a pageant, and what a way to do it. You've seen the other contestants. They were all worthy, but in the end, the judges, they did choose you. So congratulations. Wear the title with pride. Wear that crown and do good for Mother Earth. Congratulations. We'll see you at the top. Thank you so much. And congratulations to our new Miss Earth. And if you would like to see the remarkable environmental activities of all the delegates, check out the official Miss Earth Facebook page and YouTube channel. Oh, and speaking of which, the fun continues online because right after the show, we will have the first interview with the new Miss Earth and her elemental court. And you can watch that exclusively on Miss Earth's Facebook page and YouTube channel. We weathered a challenging year and with a new set of winners, we are confident that we can forge ahead and have a new beginning for each one of us and, of course, for planet Earth. This has been James Deacon saying so long, stay safe, and see you again next year!